Welcome back. It's time to defeat the last of the cursed blades. Hey, I didn't notice that. Oh, neither did I. It's nice. Yeah. The last of the cursed blades. That sounds like a like a cheesy like eighties kung fu movie. Yeah. I'd love to see that. Me too. Alright. Here we go. Have you ever seen um, Big Trouble in Little China? No. That is a cheesy 80s kung fu movie. <laughs> it it is The thing is the thing about it is is I I watched it and I don't know if it's taking itself seriously or not. It's kind of one of those movies yeah. where it's borderline um Tongue in cheek. Yeah. But if you're if you're into um Oh, there he is. Wow. <laughs> oh, we, we currently have a sword <laughs> inside uh, of our gut. <laughs> That's the look on our face, I bet too. I feel it. Uh I feel it. This guy's a bit tough. Yeah, he's his fighting his style is more effective. He's using the um the art of stabbing and blocking. <laughs> he's using the art of hurt me a lot. The hurt me a lot style of swords. Using I can't not hit his shield. That's because he's doing a good job. Whoa! Whoa. Yeah! <laughs> Alright, all the cursed blades of Sacrator have been destroyed. Their freed spirits have gone to the shrine of Tiber Septum to try to dispel the enchantment laid upon it by the Under King long ago. I should go to the shrine at once to see if they succeed in their final quest. Yeah, yeah. Did you see that? Your head went like a hundred feet into the air, man. High five. He's just like, yeah, I know. I know. All don't, right, don't fine, fine, in. whatever. I, I have Underkings to banish. Underking, that's a pretty cool name. Yeah. The Underking. The Underking. Oh, hey. The one we fear. Oh, no. The Average oh. Locked Chest. The oh. one we fear. <laughs> I am a master lock picker. Oh no. <laughs> uh, there we go. Oh, oh, that was the one. There we go. <laughs> Yay. Oh, steel gauntlets. Those are nice. Okay. Over encumbered? Over encumbered? No, yeah. Have you I'll show you the next time you pick a lock, but have you ever imagined like the, the tumblers being like little faces? <laughs> uh, no, I don't think so. I'll, I'll show you the next time you okay. pick a lock. I'm looking forward to that. And I'm wasting magic. Are you wearing a mitten? Uh, yes. Because <laughs> it looked like you were wearing a mitten. And I'm okay with that. You should hold up your fists. Like, like, like Unequipped a sword. Oh, battle! No. Okay, I need to. I need to heal real quick. Is there a ghost on both sides of you, or just one side? Doesn't matter. Both sides. That's what's the right thing. Whoa! Ha! That one was a bit high. That was. That was a uh, ball. Yeah, ball one. No! Ah, there we go. Potion of Attackracy. What the heck is that? Makes you attack really well. <laughs> yeah, it's a combination of attack and accuracy. <laughs> Fantastic. Did you get that other chest? That was there? Where? That one. Oh, no. Jade and ruby ring. Lovely. Yeah. 
I'm feeling it. This this room doesn't look very well textured to me. Cause of like that. Yeah, cause of that, and it just it just looks. All of a sudden, I walked in here and felt like I was playing a much older game. Yeah. You know I what guess. I'm saying? Like. It just. Yeah. I it's, I, I it's know not, what you it's mean. not working for me. Well, the the past. Yeah, past I was about to say. Ah, this that's, looks that's, nice. that's better. We got the good graphics back. Yeah. Ah. Wee. Do 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 do. There. <laughs> okay. So now we just have to go back to the center place and hopefully. Oop. Oh, oh, Where are you? Whoop. Was I like floating weirdly? <laughs> kind of felt like I it. I felt like I was. Maybe you harnessed your the ghostly energy of your ghost pals. That's right. I like those glowy things. I like. Yeah, me I like too. It. I want one in my living room. I want one um, in my every room. Well, that would be cool, I guess. I want, I just want this place to be my house. <laughs> <laughs> it comes with the ghosts, though. Oh. <laughs> Well, you've been doing a pretty easy job of clearing them up, you know? Yeah. Just have to vacuum up that ectoplasm. Oof. Gross. Gonna have to go to Walmart and, like, rent one of those, like, Industrial car vacuum. carpet cleaners. Because I don't think Dust Devil's gonna do it. No. Not quite. Maybe we can get, like, the vacuum from Luigi's Mansion. You know what? Surprisingly, I've, I've, surprisingly, I've never played that game. It's good. It's a good game. Mm. It, it, that's one of the best, in my opinion, it, that game is one of the best for it feels good when you pick up money. It feels so good. Really? Yeah, because, like, whenever you, like, sometimes whenever you open a drawer, like, shake curtains... Like dollar bills and coins will fall out, and you suck them up with a vacuum, huh. and they look really nice and make nice noises, and it, it the money is fantastic. Oh, it's just like super um, satisfying. Yeah, oh. and the end of the game. Oh no! Ooh. Oh, oh! <laughs> Another fear of his is water in video games. It's true. Okay. Uh huh. Seriously, it started... Can I make that jump? Yes. This is Oblivion. Use your moon boots. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay, here we go. Here we go. <laughs> Whoa. Good gosh. One small step. Like one large, one large leap, for, a leap for everyone else. One small step for me. Wow. But anyway. Yeah, it all started in um, in sh the game Shadows of the Empire on the Nintendo 64. It was the, the Star Wars game. And I, I really want to play you, that. You know the one. You know the one. The one that's epic and amazing. And good graphics. Yeah, for its time, I guess. But um, Oh, look at how epically. They're so stoic. Yeah. Okay, should I do this too? All right. Yeah. Oh, that was that was not a settling sound. The ghosts of the four cursed blades have dispelled the evil enchantment on the shrine of Tiber Septum. The way to the armor is now open. Thank you, brothers. Uh, but yeah, um, shadows of the empire. Uh, it's one of my favorite games, and I really want to play it on the channel, but later on. Armor. Put it on. Okay. Put on that armor.
But yeah, so the level, I don't know if, if you guys are familiar with that game, but the level where you are in the sewer, whoa, that looks awesome. Not bad. Dude, I don't want to give this up. I don't want to Not give this up. Bad at all. Oh man. Do you want to just forsake everyone and just take the armor? What if that's the curse? What if the curse of the armor is taking hold of us already? Oh no. Look at how pointy the shoulder bits are. I like it. I like pointy shoulder bits. So, anyways, the the uh, sewer level uh, is terrifying and. Ever since I was a child and I played it for the first time, I have an irrational fear of video game water. <laughs> yes, I said it. <laughs> Not real life water, but video game water. Because anything could be in there. It's like the difference between a bathroom in real life and a bathroom in video games. Because bathrooms are always bad news in video games, but bathrooms are always good news in real life. Well, that's arguable. <laughs> but you get the idea, at least. Or, like, stairs. No, stairs can be nice everywhere. Depends. Yeah, that's true. Ah! Yes! You know... Yes, I do. I just realized that this is actually a really cool mission. <laughs> it is. Can I jump down here? I can. And I can also walk back up. Let's <laughs> see. Um, now, how to get out. Good grief. Which way did I come in? Um, okay, that's one thing that I will say... Um, you know, reflecting upon the the modern installation installments of uh, of the Elder Scrolls series, and we ain't talking Elder Scrolls Online. Well, the, just simply because we've never played it, um, I think that I would like it from what I've heard. Uh, well, you're saying that because pretty much from what I understand, and, and you know, everyone feel free to correct me if I'm wrong. Um, the people who are who are avid like MMO players, you know, who who play World of Warcraft and stuff like that, don't like Elder Scrolls Online. But the people who are Elder Scrolls people who don't necessarily play MMOs all that much, like myself, yeah, love it. I've I've heard that it's not ho horrible. It's like a it's a pretty standard quality MMO. It's just not the quality one would expect from an Elder Scrolls game. Because really it's not. It it it's not like a, another installment in the series. Hmm. It's just uh it's just a a way to explore the world and have fun. Which sounds awesome to me. Yeah, probably give it a try. But anyway. Yeah, so anyways, it's just it's just funny to me that uh what was I even saying? Oh yeah, in, talking in, about in yeah, Skyrim yeah, yeah, yeah. the okay. easy way out. Yeah, exactly. Um, you know, reflecting upon the the, uh, the modern uh, installments, you know, Morrowind and Oblivion and Skyrim, like, you know, it's it's easy to to appreciate them all, but also to kind of compare and contrast. And one thing that I really really do like about Skyrim is how they always engineer a like an easy way to get out after you're done with the quest. And I always thought yeah. that that was really clever. Like like in the main chamber, you pull a cord that like moves a rock that you can go through the first chamber. Exactly, into. yeah. And that just seems really, um, you know, just a, just cool, like design-wise to me. Yeah, it, it's cool. I I like it for the sake of time, but sometimes for immersion, it's it's not as good. I'd like it more if it was in some, but not in all. So it's just like, now where's the easy way out? Right, and it's like, oh, well, I guess this one doesn't have one. I have to go back out or whatever. Yeah. Or maybe if it did have a quote-unquote <clears throat> quote like easy way out, like a shorter distance, mm -hmm. but there were still 
you know, Stuff maybe you had to fight. Yeah, maybe like traps or whatever. Because in Skyrim, they really do kind of, kind of like baby you at the end of, of the uh, the missions. You know, there's all this treasure, and you know, there's no more Which enemies. Feels good. It does. It does feel really, really great. But, uh, you know, like you said, for immersion, yeah, uh, maybe it's not the best. But, so yeah. All right. Well, more Elder Scrolls. Uh, uh, f- f- stuff. F- 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 stuff in the next episode. Uh, yeah, we're going to go into uh, this here temple and talk maybe about... Maybe uh, give up the armor? Maybe <laughs> not. Yeah, there's a high, high chance that uh, we are just going to quit the game right now and keep this armor. So we look good. Hey. The armor, I mean. Can I make that jump? Yes. This is Oblivion.